नेक्स्ट क्वेश्चन इज क्वेश्चन नंबर सेवेंटी वन द रिएक्शन ऑफ के एम एन ओ फोर विथ हाइड्रोजन पर ऑक्साइड इन एसिडिक कंडीशन गिवस द फर्स्ट ऑप्शन इज एम एन फोर पॉजिटिव एंड ओ टू सेकेंड ऑप्शन इज एम एन टू पॉजिटिव एंड ओ टू थर्ड ऑप्शन इज एम एन टू पॉजिटिव एंड ओ थ्री एंड फोर्थ ऑप्शन इज एम एन फोर पॉजिटिव एंड एम एन ओ टू As you know, KMnO4 is a powerful oxidizing agent in acidic medium. In acidic medium itself, it reduces to Mn2 positive. It means hydrogen peroxide will oxidize, and when hydrogen peroxide oxidizes, then product is O2. So correct option is second one. Next question, question number seventy-two. Among the following complexes. the one which shows zero crystal filled stabilization energy is first option is given mnh2o6 whole 3 positive feh2o6 3 positive coh2o6 2 positive coh2o6 3 positive now see in this question the information is about cfsc or crystal filled stabilization energy any of the complex will have zero cfsc value if its configuration is d5 or d10 because in the presence of ligand the d orbitals are split into sets one is called t2g group another one is ej group now difference between t2g set and ej set is called crystal filled splitting energy of octahedral complexes if a electron filled in t2g orbital its energy decreases by 0.4 unit and when electrons enters into eg orbital the energy increases by 0.6 dq now if configuration is d5 then three electrons will be here and two electron will be here if it is the case of weak field ligand you can see the total energy For T2g electron will be three into point minus point four, and for Eg orbital it is two into point six. So we can say if configuration of complex is D5, similarly if it is D10, then we will observe zero crystal filled stabilization energy. Now the first complex is given MnH2O6 three positive. you can see in all the four option the ligand is h2o which is a neutral ligand so in this complex metal is present in plus 3 oxidation state while in second complex iron is present in plus 3 oxidation state in third option cobalt is present in plus 2 oxidation state and in fourth option cobalt is present in plus 3 oxidation state configuration of manganese is 3d 54s2 it means in plus 3 oxidation state its configuration will be 3d 4 the configuration of iron is 3d 6 4s2 and when it is in the plus 3 state the configuration becomes 3d 5 so this complex is having exactly 5 electron so probability is that this complex will have zero cfsc value now see in case of third complex coh2o6 cobalt its atomic number is 27 its configuration is 3d 74s2 and cobalt 2 plus state configuration is 3d 7 similarly if it is cobalt in plus 3 oxidation state the oxidation state the electronic configuration will be 3d 6 so in the given four option only 
ferric complex is having exactly half filled configuration so this complex will have zero crystal filled stabilization energy and correct option is second option next question is question number 73 Magnetic moment 2.83 Bohr magneton is given by which of the following ions? First option titanium 3 positive, second option nickel 2 positive, third option Cr 3 positive and fourth option Mn 2 positive. You know that magnetic moment of any atom, ion or compound can be calculated using the formula N, N plus 2 Bohr magneton where N is the number of unpaired electron. So if we know the value of magnetic moment we can put it here 2.83 and can calculate number of unpaired electrons. After calculating the number of unpaired electron, we will check the option. When we solve this, the value of N is coming to. It means the ion must have two unpaired electron. Now see the configuration, titanium, atomic number is given 22. So titanium is having electronic configuration 3D2, 4S2. And when it is plus 3 state, then configuration becomes 3D1. So this ion is having only one unpaired electron. It can't be the answer. Atomic number of nickel is 28. So its electronic configuration is 3D8, 4S2. Since nickel is present in plus 2 state, the configuration of ion is 3D8. 3D8 it means two unpaired electrons are present so correct option is second one. Next question is question number 74. Which of the following complexes is used to be as an anti-cancer agent? First option is MER, CONH3 whole thrice Cl3. Second option is platinum Cl2 NH3 twice. Third option is cis K2PTCL2Br2 and fourth option is Na2COCl4. As we know there are so many compounds, transition metal complexes which are effective in different types of drugs and one of them is used as anti-cancer agent. Anti-cancer agent is cisplatine, a complex of platinum in which two ligands are chlorine and two ligands are ammonia. They are arranged in cis form. So correct answer is option number two.